Hello everyone, welcome to Coders Camp. So in this video, we are going to cover this problem check if word equals summation of two words. And it is one of the easy category problem which is asked in Lead Code Weekly Contest 243. Here the input given is three strings, the first word, second word and the target. And we have to return if the first word plus second word is equal to target. So here they have given us each character in the word will be assigned with an integer like a starts with 0 and goes till 25 till z and if we add the values of first word and second word which should be equal to the target in that case we have to return true otherwise we have to return false so let's consider the first example given acb cba and cdb so if you convert the first word acb then it is going to take 0 to 1 and as the zeros in the front can be ignored and the number is 21 and then the next character or the next word CBA can be represented as 210 and the target can be represented as 231 and if you add 21 and 210 it is going to be 231 again so our output is going to be true so first let me write a method which converts a string to a number so let me name it convert and it takes a string as a parameter and returns an integer value as a result so i'm declaring a variable integer variable result and i'm going to iterate my given string So inside that, I'm going to calculate my result. So which is nothing but we are going to convert each character to a number first. So this will actually convert each character to a number. So every time we convert it to a number, we are going to append it to the last of the result. So which is nothing but result plus result into 10. So it will multiply a 10 and add this number at the end. So finally the result will have us the complete converted number. So we are returning the result. So now in main method we are going to call this function to calculate the number form of these three words. So directly I am going to return convert of first word plus convert of second word is equal to convert of target word. So it simply compares and return the value accordingly. So let us run and try. So yes, let's submit. Yes, the solution is accepted. Hope I made it clear. And it runs in 0 milliseconds. So thanks for watching the video. Hope you liked this video. If you like the video, hit like, subscribe and let me know in comments. Thank you.